Hi guys, it's Nana. I'm back again today. Uh, it's not an empties video. I still have a, a couple more stuff to get through before I feel ready to film another empties. Instead, it's a haul. Yeah, there is, I, I had like a couple coupon codes and there was like sales on places and I just need, wanted to make another style order because I was dwindling down and like Wearing the mask so much has made my face all around here and my mouth so sensitive. Like everything burns. When I would use my Manuka Honey Vitamin C cleanser, mouth burned. I thought it was something else. Anyway, so I've been trying to repair my skin. I got a couple stuff that has Centella in it and ceramide. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, first thing. The Sun Bum Premium Sunscreen Spray, Broad Spectrum SPF 50. Uh, this is like a backup bottle. I already have one that I'm using. So crazy. I bought the SPF 30 because the first time I went into a specific shoppers, there's only the 30 left. And I finished that even though I swear I used it maybe like seven times. Mind you, I did get my, my whole body like if I was showing a lot of skin that day. And I did reapply again certain days, but I was like, wow, I didn't know you could go through sunscreen uh, spray that fast. Yeah, so yeah, this is the only brand of body sunscreen I will buy. I don't know, I just like it. It feels good. So yeah, got this. Okay, this is the Yes Style order. Oh my God, I'm so excited to open it with you guys. They really shipped it with DHL. That's why I got here so fast. Yes, that has this new thing. Before, you only had to spend like $42 to get free shipping. And now you have to spend like $165. And I was like, why is it so much? I guess they do that because it favors in. And then you get your stuff faster because it's got here. I mean, I made the order. And they shipped it out. Yeah, May, they said May 28th. They said May 29th they ship it. They shipped it May 28th. All the stuff in here. That's my receipt. I'll put it down there. Wow. Oh, these were the socks. These are supposed to be like... I've had these on my favorites for the longest time. Let's see if I can open it. They're supposed to be purple gray. And they are not. They're just... Do you see that? That's just gray. Yeah, I could wear that with some socks. Now I know that because there's, um, excuse me, there's a pair on Aritzia that I wanted and I wanted a bucket hat, this green bucket hat and make it like another color too because like they're cute. Um, so yeah, I was, I almost made the order on Aritzia and now I know I can make it. I, I bought the purple gray color because I have these, um, new balance shoes that are like a purplish gray color they lean more to purple though like lilac light pink like purple color sorry uh and i bought that so that i could wear this since like a monochromatic like foot look and this just isn't it so i could probably wear these with my um my stan smith adidas they would look pretty cute with it okay <gasps> ah look at this it's a mini of the advanced snail 96 mucin power essence I'm going to be using so many new skincare tonight. Okay, I'll try not to do too, too much different because I know that can cause like irritation and a bad reaction on your skin. But yeah, I'm excited to try this. The last time I tried a snail product was the Benton um, con High B Cotton, like High B Essence something. It, it was the Benton like snail sheet mask. I bought it from a recommendation from somebody else. Uh, and... I used it the first time and then I got like a bump on my forehead and I was like, okay, that's weird. And it cleared up. I'm like, okay, let me try it again. And again, it happened. I was like, are you serious? These hyped up sheet masks breaking me out. Like I want to, I want to enjoy snail products too. I want to get a product that naturally has peptides in it and like it's so absorbing and it's good for anti-aging. So yeah, hopefully this doesn't break me out and then I can buy like the full size bottle. So yeah. Okay, what's this? <gasps> it's the Sioris, my first Essener. This is smaller than I thought it would be. 
then again it is about the same size as the um the Famisa organic flowers toner <gasps> whoa it's so pretty and i love the aesthetics wow whenever i see products being used with people in videos they seem bigger than when you buy it am i the only one i feel like that's how it always is so okay another mini this is the time is running out mist oh my god i can't believe this is in my oh look at it it's so cool i guess it was like you shake it up and you spray it i'm not gonna spray it yeah i've wanted this for so long and i wasn't sure i'd love it so i'm like let me just try a mini of it the same reason why i got the snail music from the mini I've wanted this since 2018. Yeah. It's the Sung Jung uh, Relief Toner with a pH of 5.5. This is going on my face soon. Probably not today. I just want to finish the little bit that I have left of the um, Make Prem Chaga Concentrate Essence in my little Look to the People Mist bottle. I just repurposed that bottle to spray toner or mist essence because it's just such a nice mechanism. Oh my god. This is the Dr. Circle uh, Kombucha Vegan Tea Essence. Oh my god. Yo, all these things are like stuff like, I'll be like, oh, I want that so bad. But then it's like, I don't want to spend money. But like, it's like, okay. A lot of stuff has been tipped over, so you can't see it. But yeah, wow, I'm actually holding this. Like I see all my favorite influencers on YouTube buy this stuff and show it. And now it's actually in my hands. Like that's so cool. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna love using that. I will think I'll really love using that in the winter because it seems like close to the Laneige Cream and Skin Skin Refiner, which I also got a mini and I'll show you that right now uh-huh honey yeah because some people mentioned not really enjoying it so instead of buying the full size even on yes style if i got it cheaper i thought let me just get a mini first and try it out and then then i'll get it so yeah but yeah i look forward to using this oh my god the keep cool and soothe tone uh bamboo toner I, not again another mini i'm into minis because i just want to try stuff like i don't know if i'm gonna love it so why would i get like a full size it's not really my my deal so yeah like a lot of people really like this and so i wanted to try it out so yeah um wow why is the bottom of the box open i don't know how this works Okay, I think I fixed it. Doesn't really matter because it's not gonna be in the bags. I'm gonna start using this. Pronto, pronto. I'm putting it right here. This is the, wow, this is smaller. Everything looks smaller, okay. Comfort Ceramide Cream Mix, Ceramide 6 Complex. I was gonna buy a bunch of other creams with ceramides and I just realized like, calm down, like you have enough because I'm trying to heal the irritation. Um, yeah, wow, it basically says all the ingredients right here. Yeah, so I'm excited to use this tonight. It's, like I said, the Coaster X Comfort Ceramide Cream Mist. Yeah, I look forward to using this. sheet mask this is the real nature i love sheet masks that have a cream like serum instead of like the watery less viscous serum i bought some at winners in 2019 like it was just like some kind of like random brand i was i didn't even know if i like it oh my goodness the way it replenished my the moisture in my skin 
unmatched by any other sheet masks I've tried. So I was like, okay, if I'm gonna get a sheet mask, these ones are like clean the shea butter. So yeah. And I wanted to just try this. This is like four dollars for one. And I found it for three or two something on Salvana. So I'm gonna get on Salvana if I like it after I try this. It's the Sunjung Sheet Mask Panthen Panthen Society. It's Panthenol and Medicast Society together. So yeah, I'm excited to try that. Okay. Two packs of sheet masks. This is the Dr. Jart Sikapair Tiger Grass Calming Mask. I love Dr. Jart and I love the Sikapair line that he has. Uh, and I read the back, there's no like denatured alcohol in here. So it's just calming and soothing and also moisturizing, which I think I'm really gonna enjoy. And then I got a brightening mask and this has vitamin C in it. I think it's just okay, I don't know. But like, I still wanna like use it, so yeah. Here we go, guys. Do you see this? Do you see this? Four times five, 20 masks. And I have four in here. It's 24. And another five pack, 29. I have almost 30 of these Dr. Jart serum mining uh, facial barrier masks. The serum that they put in the sheet mask is incredible. The way that it just like super moisturized my skin and just seemed to like repair my skin is almost unmatched. I, tr I thought I would find the same serum in the, the liquid that he does of this, the liquid version of the ceramide. But then I was reading reviews and but first I double checked the ingredients and the third ingredient was alcohol. That's weird. I was like, okay, maybe they put it in to deliver as like a way to deliver the serum into your skin, like an agent like that. But no, a lot of people when they reviewed it said that actually their skin started getting really dry and irritated. So they had to stop using it. I was like, okay, wow, I guess it's not good. So every time I go into a winner's and I see one of these, I buy them. I hoard them. I love this so much. I'm not using it in summer. I'm saving these for winter when my skin gets really dry and it's like hard to keep hydration. So yeah. Okay, let's do one. Let me put, oh, I forgot a sunscreen. So this is the Aveeno Sensitive Skin Ultra SPF 50 Ultra Light Mineral Sunscreen. I'm going to use this in the winter um, because it's just like the... The Etude House um, Sun Prize Mild Airy Finish sunscreen that I use, but that one has alcohol in it, so it's like easier to wear in the summer when your skin doesn't feel as dry. It's what I'm wearing today on my face and my neck. Um, so I'm gonna use this in the winter because it doesn't have alcohol in it, so it's not drying, and it's a good base for any of the liquid foundations that I use. It might be even decent. No, I don't think I'll use it in powder in there. But yeah, so any of the liquid foundations. Okay, hold on y'all. Hopefully this opens. Interesting wrapping paper. Damn, I want to keep it. Yeah, I didn't get any. Ah, this is my favorite foundation. It's the NARS All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. A lot of people do not like this foundation because it doesn't last. If you have oily skin, you won't like this. But I have dry skin and very dehydrated skin, so it seems pretty. Okay, this, look at how similar they seem. This one is definitely, this one will probably be good for the summer. When I wear this, it goes on so orange, but then it dries down yellow undertone. 
which is weird. And this also looks pretty orange, right? That you'll dry down to a nice yellow undertone. So yeah, I won't be using this yet. I'm gonna finish the that one that's in New Orleans. And this is Benares or Benares. I don't know how to pronounce the name. I actually tried to um, find the pronunciation. Oh, come on. There's a thing in here. The pronunciation of this. And all it brought me was that it's like a province in India, but it wouldn't put beside the name, the pronunciation, which I need to know. So that is something difficult that I have to deal with. Oh. Okay, there's more. This is from Indeed Labs. Yeah, you guys, I love that foundation. It just makes you look perfect, okay? Like flawless. And it is luminous. I went from Macau to New Orleans, now Bonaire's. That just keeps getting darker. Oh my God, I'm so excited to use this. I'm gonna use this tonight. This is the Indeed Labs No Acid Pads, a gentle alternative to acids. I wish I knew about this back in like 2017, 2018 because like my skin was so sensitive before like I couldn't use acids. I could, everything like irritated my skin before. I wouldn't get irritation like burning but like my skin would get dark from stuff. And I was like why is this happening and apparently, and I bear, I don't, I don't know how I just knew like intuitively like people with Fitzpatrick's 5 to 8, I don't know if 8 is the last one but like darker skin people when you use a product and you get darker from it that's a sign of irritation that's how our bodies deal with irritation it causes our melanocytes to like over like overwork like they become overactive in white people and lighter skin people they get red and they know that's irritation but for us we don't know that but i knew that and i got confirmation of that from a doctor and from a dermatologist i saw so yeah, uh, hopefully these are pretty gentle and they won't like irritate my skin. I know glycolic doesn't really do that and I wear sunscreen all the time so that's fine. So yeah, I'm excited to try this. I got it because Indie Labs sells these, my favorite. These are the Indie Labs Bakuchi All Reface Pads. These really do work. Like my skin became... Okay, yeah, I guess. Hold on. The way my skin just like improved with these, I would do this after washing my face to uh, double cleanse. Then I use the one of these. Then I spray my face or like wet my face with the um, Make Prem Chaga Concentrate Essence, and then uh, a serum, some kind of oh the Hyaluronic Acid Toner by Isn't Tree. Then I go over it with the Inkyless CoQ10 serum, um, the Q10 serum and a moisturizer either the acure radically rejuvenating night cream or the canadian beaver or green beaver um extra dry skin face cream every day that i woke up i'm telling you my skin was glowing and so clear this i'm sure of it has something to do with it so yeah i got three of these two three and one of these and from now on, I'm gonna be buying my reface pads from Indie Labs, their actual um, website, because they're $17.99 on Indie Labs, but they were $19.99 at Shoppers. And sometimes on sale, they were $15.99. But I also had a coupon for my first time buying them with them, and I got 20% off. So, yeah, that wasn't too bad. And Indie Labs gave me an instant skin blurring. Excuse me. Um, no blur, minimize the look of enlarged pores. Oh, uh, we'll see about that. Okay. And they sent me another thing. Aw, and just, they're so cute. They, like, they 
in my order they said thank you for your order nana we hope you enjoy your new goodies we love your feedback at indeedlabs.com xo the indeed labs team i mean i already gave a, re a review on the bakuchio reface pads so i think i'm good there okay oh. okay here we go the style vanna box Order three things, really. Okay, I ordered three things from uh, Stalvana. This is the uh, Beauty of Joseon Ginseng Essence Water. Again, this is another product I'd be seeing people share with online. I can't believe it's in my hands. Like, ah! Oh my god. Um, yeah, so ginseng is great. It's great for anti-aging and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm gonna enjoy this. Probably start using it after I finish the um the ch the first chaga uh ch bottle that I have. So that's it. Try it. Oh, they sent a little Purito deep sea water thing. That's interesting. These, these are so I remember. Ah, oh my god. Yeah. This is the Sika Pear cream. It's their new iter it's a second iteration. Now it contains four thousand times more. Centella Asiatica, Madagascar side, Gochi Cola, whatever you want to call it, than it did before. Ow. Hopefully it opens. Yeah. I saw this. Like a picture on like Twitter or no, it was on Tumblr. And I wanted to get it because it looked cool. Like it just looked nice in the lay that someone had done, like a blogger girl took a picture. And that's the only reason I wanted it because it looked cool. And then it turned out to be a really beneficial product. Before I only needed the tiniest bit because it was incredibly rich. And my skin was very like acne prone sensitive back then. Like I've been telling you, like my skin, my skin was so sensitive to stuff. Like I couldn't even use this. It was too rich. And now my skin just devours stuff that's so rich. I'm going to actually put it out here. Whenever I need extra. And the last thing is the Sunjung Pantman No Side Sika Balm. This is just like Okay, this hasn't been used. I was so scared. Guys, like, it came all like, you see that smush? I was like, oh my god, did somebody use it? I was like freaking out. No. Okay, well, that's the last thing. That's all I have for the haul. I hope you enjoyed watching. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.